Hello everyone, my name is Confidence and in this video, I'd like to show you how to use the one-click deploy to Heroku feature to self-host your AppSmith instances. Right here, I'm on the documentation page and we have a deploy to Heroku button. I'll be leaving the link this button points to in the description below to make it easy for you to self-host your AppSmith instance. So I'm going to go ahead to click on this button and I'll be taken to my dashboard where I can go ahead to configure my AppSmith instance. So the first thing I want to do here would be to provide a name for this application. So I'm just going to call this my AppSmith. And then I can go ahead to set a region. I think the default region is fine. And then I would want to also configure the environment variables. There are about four required environment variables. I'm going to be taking a look at each one of them in this video, but you may also want to take a look at the others depending on your use case. So the first is to disable telemetry. This is set to false by default. The next is to set an encryption password, and this will be used to encrypt all credentials stored in AppSmith. So I'm just going to set the password such as one, two, three, four, five, six. The next is to set an encryption sort for that password. So I'm just going to type in something like A, B, C, D. And lastly, we also want to supply the required MongoDB URI. So I'm just going to paste um, a MongoDB URI I already have. And make sure that the database path is the actual database you want your AppSmith instance to have access to. All right, so we have the required um, environment variables configured. Now we can scroll down to deploy our application by clicking on the deploy button. And we can see that our application is being created. So let's give this some time and check things out when it is ready. All right, my application has been deployed and here we can go ahead to take a look at it. So I can click on the view app button and then I'll be taken to the dashboard of my AppSmith application. All right, let's give this some time to load up. All right, so here I can go up to create a new account by clicking on the sign up and then I'll provide my email. And then I want to go ahead to supply a password for that email. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six. And then I can go ahead to sign up And here I'm taking to my AppSmith dashboard where I can create my application. So let's create a new application. And let us bring in a button widget. And we can go ahead to deploy this application by clicking on the deploy button. And here we can see our application with a single button. So this is how easy you can self-host your AppSmith instance by using the one click to deploy to Heroku. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, leave a like, get subscribed, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.